Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, I will be sharing a baby girl clothing haul. I hope you guys are excited, and I will be throwing in some extra little items that I have for Miss Olivia. If you're new to my channel, I'm Bianca, and I have a sweet, precious baby girl, Olivia Kate, and she is currently seven and a half months, and she is a preemie girl, so her adjusted age is five and a half months. So let's go ahead and get started. So some of this stuff I got on Supercell, and it is like, um, some summer items. So like I mentioned that this is going to be a collective haul and I got some of this stuff right at the end of summer. So Olivia has kind of wore a lot of the stuff I'm about to show you. We live in Texas. It's hot. It's hot today. So she's getting some use out of those items while we transition into the cooler kind of ish weather. So let's go ahead and get started with some Old Navy items. So when you purchase from Old Navy, you can also get stuff from Baby Gap. And I got this adorable little sweater. I think it is oh so cute. Uh, like I mentioned, Olivia is seven and a half months old. She is wearing zero to three months. And then I did get some three to six month items because um, she does have really long legs. So I did pick this up in a three to six month since it, it's going to be a while before she can wear this since it's so hot down here. It is from Baby Gap. I believe it was called like their rainbow sweater. I'm not really sure. If I can find links to anything, I'll have it linked down below. But this was just absolutely adorable. Also, if I have pictures of Olivia wearing any of these items, I will also insert those as well. I love this and I actually have a sweater like this. So had to. Okay, next up are these little overalls here. They're absolutely adorable. I picked these up in a zero to three months and she has wore these quite a few times. I even styled her in some like little DIY Halloween costumes. They were definitely a great buy. I want to say everything at Old Navy was either 20 or 30% off and all of the sell items I was still able to get an additional percent off as well. So here is one of those like super sell items because it was a summer item. It's this little linen dress. I think it's so adorable. I love how it's cream but it has the pops of the bright colors. It is so cute. So this was adorable. Uh, these little jogger pants from Old Navy are absolutely adorable. These are in zero to three months. So the issue here is they fit her like perfectly but in the length they look like little capris because baby girl is seven and a half months but they're so cute and they're comfy cozy i love the stripes here so i picked her up this or those little pants as well as this little onesie oh my goodness it is oh so stinking cute the onesie is absolutely adorable it's ribbed this next outfit i think is absolutely adorable and it's definitely that perfect little piece if you live in texas where we transition from our summer to fall but it's still summer so this is absolutely adorable i believe this is like a linen material but it's a long sleeve on olivia it might might be a little shorter for her since she is, you know, longer and she is a preemie. Here are the little bloomer shorts that are absolutely adorable. I love how I could style this little top with some jeans and then I could style these little bloomers with a onesie. These are so cute, which actually leads me into the next onesie. So I have a few of these. She's already warm and they're downstairs on her cart. She has a few of these in the short sleeve. Oh my goodness, they're perfection. The little ribbed onesies from Old Navy, I highly recommend. This one here is a zero to three month and it's the long sleeve. It's very, it's exactly like this one. It has the really adorable little sleeves here. So these are super cute. So I love how I can like interchange all of these. She could wear these two together and it could kind of look like a one piece. And then she has already wore this together like that. And this was really cute. Okay, next up at Old Navy, I picked her up some boyfriend jeans. They are in zero to three months and they actually fit perfect in the length, even with this like little rolled up hem. They are so stinking cute. I do have an actual button. These are not friendly when you're changing diapers. You gotta take, take it all off. So these are just 
so cute. I love, I love these so much. Another little sell item from Old Navy. I want to say I paid like $2.49 for these adorable little sandals. They are so cute. I mean, clearly they were a summer item. They are a little big because they are a size one and Olivia is still in a newborn size for her shoes, but they are just so adorable. Okay, there. I did have one more thing from Old Navy. Let's see if it's in here. Yes, okay, it is. It's right here. We have this adorable little corduroy dress. I did buy this separately from all of that stuff. That was like one haul online. And then this, I believe everything was 30% off that day. So this it's just so adorable and it does have little pockets. I love this. Okay, moving on to Carter's. I picked her up a little blue jean jacket. Is this not the cutest thing you've ever seen? It is absolutely adorable. It is a light wash blue jean jacket and the little button snap. There we go. I did pick it up in a size three months. And it was regular price $40, but I know for sure that it was on sale. I did pick her up these little onesies. They are short sleeves. I picked her up a set of the short sleeve and a set of the long sleeves because I absolutely love making little onesies for her, which here is one of the long sleeve onesies that I made for her. It's a little glittery pumpkin that says Olivia. Okay, another little item from Carter's is this little dress here that my mom and my sister got for her. It is absolutely adorable. I literally like would wear this dress myself. Um, it's in three months and I think it's so pretty. Look at the little sleeves. I think it's so darling. And then they got her some little yellow shoes. I don't have them right here because she actually just wore them to the pumpkin patch. So I will insert a picture of her wearing the little shoes. And then I picked her up two pairs of shoes. One of them I don't think I have here with me either. They are brown and they have their little brown flats with little butterflies. I'll insert a picture of her wearing them. And then I also picked her up these little flats. Oh my goodness, they are so, so cute. Um, these little shoes were on sale for $10 each. Regular price, $22. Okay, another little item that my mom had got her. You guys would have seen that little dress in this little outfit in a recent vlog. But it's this one here and it says, Thankful for Family. It has an adorable little turkey on it. I think this is just so cute. She's going to look adorable in this. And this is in the size zero to three months. Okay, a couple of things from Walmart. This is in the size three to six months. I went up in this one just because when she wears things that are like a one piece bodysuit, again, she's so like tall or she's so long. I wanted to make sure it fit her like a little bit better in the length and I can always like dry it if it's just like a little too big. This is just a cute little one piece. It is light cream. It is ribbed and it is by Modern Moments by Gerber and I'm going to put like a little pumpkin right here. I think this is so, so cute. It's just super simple. I think they also had it in gray. And then we have this little onesie here that is absolutely adorable from Walmart. It, it's a little two-piece set. It comes with a little headband. And this was regular price. There's no price on it. I don't really remember how much this was, but this is so cute just to be super festive. Okay, next up I have two items that I got off of Amazon. So I feel like with Amazon and baby clothing, it's just a hit or miss due to sizing. I feel like sizing is just completely like weird and a little off. I always read the reviews before I purchase it and still you'll have 50% of the people saying like too big size down or too small size up. So uh, whenever I ordered this, it was too big. Like this will fit her now, but whenever it came in, it was absolutely too big. Um, I think that it was the sizing where it was like a zero to six month. This is absolutely adorable. The quality is amazing. It reminds me of her little Cuddle and Kind dolls. I think it is darling. Another little set that I bought for Christmas and it came with this little top here 
and it came with these little pants. The pants are absolutely adorable. I feel like the little top, it's not the best quality. Like the neckline looks like it's a little, it's a little wonky, but the little pants are super cute. Again, this had like weird sizing. I want to say it was like zero to six months. Um, so we'll see, but I just thought the little pants were so cute. Okay, another Amazon item that I just repurchased is another set of bows. So if you watch any of my vlogs or if you follow me on Instagram, you will notice that Olivia is always wearing like one of these bows and they are our favorite bows. They are a very large headband. They're very stretchy. They don't leave indentions in her head. We love these bows so, so much. So this is my second set. I'll leave both of them in the description box below. The first set we absolutely love. I believe it comes with 16 or 20 bows, but it was missing a few colors. Um, and I didn't notice it in the summertime, but as we started moving into the holiday seasons, I was like, okay, we don't have a red and we don't have an orange. We didn't have like a creamy color. So I ordered this set here. So this bow right here came from the first original set. It's like a very light, kind of a khaki color. Absolutely love it. You get a big pack. I believe this big pack of 20 bows was $16.99. You just literally cannot beat that and it comes with such a variety of colors. So we highly recommend these bows. Okay, moving right along to Dillard's, y'all. Oh my goodness, these little outfits are so, so stinking cute. I can't. So Olivia has wore a few of these outfits, like this one right here. My mom and my dad got her this little outfit. It's so precious. It's literally darling. She wore it to the pumpkin patch. It's navy blue. So adorable, y'all. And then I got her this little one here, and it says, Mama is my boo. I absolutely love the polka dots, the bright orange, the foo-foo. This is just everything. Okay, here is another little outfit that I got her at Dillard's. She actually has already wore this one as well. It is a little apple outfit. It is so stinking cute. I did get this one in three to six months because I wanted it to last, you know, November as well. So it comes with the little apple pants in that very like soft ivory color. It is beautiful. It has a little peplum top. I think this little outfit was just darling. And just two more clothing items from Dillard's. We have these adorable little Christmas outfits. <gasps> Y'all, oh my goodness, aren't these precious? Let's take a look at this one here. It has the beautiful Christmas tree. I love the little like raglan style top with the striped sleeves, cute little tutu bottom. The polka dots just make it look so fun and whimsical. You do get this like little pop of green trim down here at the bottom. And then the little pants are red and white striped. And I did get this in a three to six month because I figured we have about half of October, all of November before she can wear this. She'll more than likely be three to six months by then. Okay, next up we have this adorable little Christmas one piece, again with the little bell sleeves, a much smaller bell bottom than the little pumpkin outfit. It has a large, large polka dots. I think this is going to look so cute. I can just see her watching mama bake cookies wearing this adorable little outfit. This is just too cute. Okay, so those are all of the clothing items that I picked up and now I'm going to share a few books. Miss Olivia absolutely loves book time, story time. So for her Halloween basket that I'm making her, I picked her up this little book here and it is Babies Love Halloween. This is just so, so cute. And I'll leave a link to this book in the, I'll leave a link to all the books in the description box below. I'm letting her play with this and read it now. I mean, she's a baby, so like she won't know whenever I make her little Halloween trick or treat basket that she's been playing with all of these items. I just wanted her to get use out of the items during the season. So we have been loving this little book here, as well as the Itsy Bitsy Pumpkin book. Now I bought that book last year when I was 
pregnant with Miss Olivia and I got it on clearance at Walmart during the after Halloween clearance sale. So I just picked it up then and it literally warms my heart that back then I picked it up knowing like I'll be reading with my baby next year and she loves that book. We read it every morning, every afternoon and literally every night. It is such a cute book. So Megan found this book at Marshall's and it is the Itsy Bitsy Snowman. Like how perfect is that? She loves the Itsy Bitsy Pumpkin. Meg found the Itsy Bitsy Snowman. The Marshall's price was $3.99 for this book. Y'all, these little books are just absolutely adorable. So I will be holding on to this one for a little while longer. Moving along to two more books that Megan found at Aldi. Y'all, do not hesitate on Aldi. If you've never been before, you do have to put a quarter into the basket to use it, but you will get your quarter back at the end. And again, if you've never been, you have to bag your own groceries. So I would take in my own reusable bags. If you are in a state or a county that isn't allowing reusable bags, you can just keep all of your items in your basket. And when you get to the car, you can bag your own items at your car. Okay, so Meg found these two books there and they I believe were $5.90 no $5.49 so it says regular price US is $7.99 this book for sure at Target is $8.99 and then at Aldi it was $5.49 so that was literally such a great deal and this is your my little pumpkin pie so I am going to give this one to her now and I will probably like put it in what I'm going to give her for Thanksgiving I love that they had different books other than Halloween but still fall related so that we could use this after October and then the itsy bitsy spider since she loves the itsy bitsy pumpkin Meg found the itsy bitsy spider and I'm sure she's going to love this I will probably go ahead and put this in her her Halloween basket but I mean we'll be able to read this all year long so this is adorable and again the Aldi books were $5.49 and Meg FaceTimed me when she was in there I believe there was like Toy Story all the books were like this so baby friendly there was Toy Story something with like I think there was like a Mickey Mouse or a Minnie Mouse and they all weren't necessarily like Halloween related so score on these and then another score at Kohl's. Oh my goodness. If, if you've been following me for a while over on Instagram, I feel like I haul these a few times a year. I absolutely love the Kohl's Cares line. They always come out with a plushed stuffed animal in a book and they donate the proceeds. The plushed stuffed animal is always $5 as well as the book. Well, they have started doing these here where the book is attached. Typically, you can have your choice of buying the book and or the stuffed animal, but here you get both. And this little set is $9. So we have Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer as well as the little book. This is adorable. I love collecting these little stuffed animals in the books. I'll probably give these items to her after Thanksgiving so that we can start reading and letting her enjoy the little stuffed animals for the entire Christmas season. So we have Rudolph. We also have Frosty the Snowman. Oh my goodness y'all. How adorable is Mr. Grinch? So I had to get Mr. Grinch and he of course is attached to How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Alrighty, the last item that I'll be sharing today is the Nutra Bullet Baby. Oh my goodness. I have actually already used this, so this is just the empty box. We absolutely love our Nutribullet baby. Um, Meg did purchase this for Miss Olivia, and we're thankful for that. Thank you, Aunt Meg. We love our little baby bullet. Miss Olivia has just been recently introduced to carrots. Of course, you don't need like something specific like that to make your own fresh baby food at home but it comes with everything that you need. It has extra little containers that you can stuff and then put in the freezer. I absolutely love it and it's a fun little treat for me to be able to use. Miss Olivia, like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, is seven and a half months old and she is a preemie baby, so we did get the approval with her pediatrician to be able to start introducing some veggies. Um, and you know guys, like it's been a journey. I remember, <sighs> 
Okay, gonna get a little emotional here. Um, celebrating, we celebrate all the things. We celebrate the little things, we celebrate the big things, and honestly, the little things are big things to us. Um, being able to make baby food for Olivia and feeding her, you know, her little carrots for the first time, um, it was a big deal for us. I remember, I remember being wheeled down to the NICU and, you know, seeing my baby being fed through the tube. And I was waiting for the day that she was strong enough and had gained enough to be able to try to breastfeed her and then to be able to bottle feed her. And it was a process and it's definitely been a journey. I remember being in the NICU and we had to actually like cut back on her times so that she was able to breastfeed because we didn't want, the doctors didn't want her to lose weight. So if she did lose weight overnight, then we'd have to cut back on the breastfeeding or we'd have to take a bottle feeding out and, you know, just wait for her to be able to be strong enough to proceed and look at her now. She's seven and a half months. She's thriving and I'm able to make and feed my baby girl carrots. That is a huge deal for us. We are so thankful, I thank God every day for picking me to be her mama. I wanna to continue to be able to share those little moments and be able to have these little talks with you guys whenever I you know, feel it on my heart to be able to share and when God gives me the strength to be able to share it like today. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this little haul from my sweet precious girl. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not already subscribed. Hit that notification bell so that you won't miss my next upload. And before you go, if you have a favorite little outfit that you saw today or maybe a favorite book or something that you would like to pick up for a loved one, let me know in the comments down below. Again, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.